I do a little bit of web hosting and I like to back my servers up. And <laughs> for that, I use Dervish, which is a useful tool that runs over, uses rsync over SSH. Um, in order to have a bit more security, because it needs at least read access um, to read everything, um, I use um, SSH forced commands, which means that the co only one command can be run by that SSH key. Unfortunately, I also want to do multiple backups per server, and with the forced command, that means each each key can only one run one run run one command, so I have to have multiple keys, which gets really messy. I have a huge list of keys. So um, the answer to that was I wrote a script, a Perl wrapper script that goes around, that is called as the single forced command, and it checks the environment variable SSH original command and checks it and looks up whether it's allowed to back up that directory and then runs the rsync command. So that's where it's getting that here. Um, it checks a file name, a list of file names, a uh, list of directory names, um, and stuffs it into a hash that so can access it this is going to be much less than five minutes. Um, <laughs> um, so if it checks it, uh, yeah, so it's had to parse the command somewhere here. Um, unfortunately, some of the options to rsync are not documented by the rsync people. They seem reluctant to do that. They're only used on the server end. Um, so I just have to capture them, hope they're right, and pass them through. Um, I should probably be using taint mode or something to check some of this stuff. I don't know. Um, and I wish I could find out what these other things did. But, <laughs> <laughs> but they, they've changed since I first set it up because I, used, I just dumped out the original command in order to work out what was happening. And I'm pretty sure most of those weren't there when I originally set this up. So... Um, yeah, so it does all that and calls rsync with the appropriate options. So it's quite simple and it's the very first thing I've uploaded to GitHub, which I did last night. So, <laughs> so that's it.